Alright, so guys, we are back with another video. And today we got things your parents tell you that was complete lies. That are complete lies. So tell us self explanatory, guys. They're gonna be showing us things that our parents told us that was lies. Let's just get right into it. Alright, number one right here, it says drinking coffee will stunt your growth. I heard this one a lot. You guys probably heard this one as well. So suppose this is a lie. It says auto caffeine, caffeine isn't the best thing to give to a child. It will not stunt a child's growth according to various studies. So guys, I'm guessing you guys could drink coffee without stunting your growth. I know you guys probably heard that before. If you drink coffee, it stunts your growth or any type of caffeine. It will stunt your growth, but obviously they just said it was not true. And look at it, it says, just coffee for me today, black, like I feel on the <laughs> inside. <laughs> I really got the kids saying, oh, wow. Number two right here says, you will get cramps if you swim within 30 minutes of eating. Always heard that, guys. Every time you say, don't swim like 30 minutes after you eat. Always heard that. So it says, eating does not cause a child danger in water in any way parents need to come up with a, some better excuses. So I still thought this today that if you got in the water, that after you right after you eat you get sick and stuff like that so or get cramps real cramps so i guess it's not true maybe it's true for some people but mostly i guess it's not true so uh, i guess you guys could eat away and then get in the pool right away this summer <laughs> number three the family pet isn't home anymore because she lives on a happy farm <laughs> we all know this is a parent's happy way of saying we sent the annoying dog back to the pound <laughs> let's go <laughs> i ever heard this before but i know they i know parents would probably be like oh if something happened to the if something happened to the um the animal or the pet they like make up an excuse like oh it went this way it went that way or stuff like that number four if you touch a toe you will get warts i've never heard of this before never heard of this before what is this look at this look, what is this Ugh. that don't want to that look creepy let me know if you ever heard that before it says children are most like oh children are more likely than adults to get warps and it's not because they are touching frogs it's because their immune systems are still developing frogs have no correlation with children's and warts so yeah guys, I guess you guys can touch all the frogs you want, but I know there's this one frog that's super, super deadly. Don't touch that one. I can't think of the name right now of that frog, but I know that frog is super, super dangerous, guys. Um, Yeah, like if you touch it, if you lick it or something like that, get, I don't know, if you get in your skin cells, it can like, it's like super poisonous or something. Y'all probably don't know what I'm talking about, which frog, but I, just, I don't forgot the name of it. It's something, something crazy, you know. It's like a yellowish type blackish frog. <laughs> okay, it says five. If you eat the fruit seed, a tree will grow in your stomach. I've always heard about this one. Definitely. Everybody used to always joke around and stuff. People thought it was real. Like, still, like if you swallow a seed, whatever fruit seed will start growing in your stomach. I used to always think that was true. If you still believe this, I am sorry for being the giver of bad news. But yeah, guys, it's not true. Okay, so if you guys still believe that, don't worry about it. No tree will grow in your stomach. Number six, if you sit too close to the TV, it will ruin your eyesight. Oh, I saw this one all the time. All the time I see, I heard about this one, guys. I always heard this all the time. Uh, this is completely false. It turns out that the children are better in focusing up close than adults are. So, wow, I still thought that about like, going too close to the TV screen or uh, the computer screen and stuff or got your phone too close that, you know, you messed your eyesight off. So I guess it's not true, though. Look as close as you want. <laughs> But not too close. Seven, looking inside the microwave while it's on will mess up your future babies. Your babies will be okay unless your microwave has some sort of leak in it. Get it checked out. <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard about this one. Um, I know about the radiation, it can kind of mess like stuff up. That's why when you're taking an uh, x-ray and stuff like that, they'd be giving you these like these weird, these weird things to put on like your like your side and, you, and put on your lap and stuff because the radiation can mess stuff up. But Number eight, there are dye in pool water that will turn your pee red. This turns out to be completely fake and for some reason we believe our parents every time. Um, I thought they, they actually had something, not red, I thought it, it turns it blue blue guys not red I thought it would turn it blue like if you pee in a pool certain pools it'll turn blue not red but they said it's a myth but I think I heard about people who, like actually had something like that th I'm not sure let me know if you guys ever seen anybody but I thought it was, it's not red though. I heard it was blue like it would turn like dark dark blue so everybody know that you peed or something number nine eight, eating carrots will give you night vision <laughs> Carrots contain vitamin A in it, which are good for your eye health. And carrots contain carotene, which the body converts to vitamin A. Sally, it won't help you see better. Always did. Yeah, I already said that. Um, carrots make you see better. Uh, but 
see better at night, but it's still good for your eyes and body. So yeah, it's still good for your eyes and bodies, guys. So keep eating them carrots. Number 10, if you swallow your gum, it will stay in your stomach for seven years. Yeah, guys, I always freaking hear about this. Every time I hear about this one. Um, it says with all the gum that we and our parents step on and get stuck in our hair, you would think that parents want us to swallow our gum. When you swallow gum, your stomach keeps the digestive process going and it doesn't leave gum behind. So wow, I still to this day thought that was true. So it's not true, so it doesn't really get stuck. So I mean, I can swallow gum every time I want. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. All right, guys, that was some lies that parents told us that we believed were true. So most of that stuff I did hear about, it looked like two or three that I didn't really hear about, but most of them I did. Let me know if you guys got any more um, lies that you know you found out later on that was a lie that your parents told you down below. Let us all know, guys. Make sure you guys leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Ah.